Hey YouTube, it's Lovelicious Toy here and I am coming to you with I think my first video. It's going to be basically a beauty routine haul because I'm of a certain age, mm -mm, over 30, but you know, that's all y'all need to know. So what I've been doing with my skin lately is I've been wearing makeup lately. I have been trying different regimens and routines, you know, keep my skin as youthful as possible. As you can see, I, I don't have breakouts or anything like that. Just putting my face in the light so you can see. Now, this is before I wash my hair. So, I mean, excuse me, <laughs> before I wash my face. So, this is just, after I've worked all day, this is what I look like. <laughs> I don't wear makeup and all day and every day like that. But, you know, I'm getting into it. So, my skin is pretty decent. So this is what I'm doing to maintain it. When I do wear makeup and I take it off, I use this Bare Facial Cleansing Oil by Julep. It did come in one of my Julep boxes. And one of the things that it says is that it dissolves makeup and dirt. So I don't have oily skin. I don't have dry skin. I think I have normal skin. But I wanted to try this cleansing oil. I was a little bit nervous. I never... I've heard about um, oil cleansing, but I've never tried it before. But I tried it to dissolve the makeup off my face on your dry face, and it really works. It really gets the makeup off. So when the days that I do wear makeup, I do use this in the evening to take it off. What I do at night, because I think at night is just as important as during the day just as what you do at night is like cell rejuvenation and it's really like taking the time to you know care for your skin at night when it's really not being disturbed by the environment sun whatever whatever so after I cleanse with that I usually let my face just kind of air dry and relax and sometimes if I feel like I have on like extra mascara or little eye makeup may have not gotten off all the way I'll use this regular old Equate Walmart brand astringents just like Sea Breeze. It doesn't bother my skin. It doesn't dry it out or anything. I'll get the remaining, if any, remaining like hard mascara or if I've piled it on that day, I'll use some of this to get it off. And it doesn't bother my eyes or anything like that. And then to moisturize at night, I've been using this Yonka. You can see that. Yonka brand. And this stuff is honey bye it is amazing i love it when you put it on at night i put it on a good little amount like a dime size and i put it on my face and my neck and you can just feel a nice smooth like you can feel the sensation that this stuff is like working but it's not like warming up or heating up or anything it's just if you were to go back 10 minutes later and touch your face your face still feels as though that this product is working on it I, you just gotta try it that's the only thing I can think of to say but this is what I do at night now for everyday cleansing in the morning when I get up and it's time to go to work I am a Novino girl these are my go-to everyday regular cleansing products Aveeno positively radiant and it works for me awesome I love it get up in the morning wash my face with two squirts of this, wash my face and my neck with two squirts of this, and then let my face air dry, tap it, let it air dry, and then I moisturize with Positively Radiant Daily Moisturizer. It has SPF 15 in it, Broad Spectrum 15. I'll get back to you on what Broad Spectrum means, but uh, I'm pretty sure it's good for your skin because my skin is, you know, responding well to what I've been doing lately. Now, Every girl does a mask here and there. So when I do masks, I either do my Aveda Intensive Hydrating Mask. And I love this mask. It is super cool. Super, super cool. You put this on and you lay it over your skin. And it like warms up. But it doesn't get hot. It just warms up. And you can just feel like your face and your your pores are just opening up and it's just being moisturized in such a wonderful way. This right here 
it's pretty darn awesome. I love this. I probably use this about twice a month. I don't do it too often because, like I said, I don't have dry skin. I don't have oily skin. I think I have normal skin. And twice a month, just because I like it, I think it does give me a nice glow. Um, I might start doing it more. I'm not sure. But this is something that I've been using about every other weekend. And I like it. I really do. Now, this mask is another mask by Julep, the Mask Noir. And this is a power cell complex type of mask. And it, what it does is, I guess when you put it on there, like, gets in your pores. And it's rejuvenating all your skin cells. And it's making your skin renew itself underneath. But the cool thing about it is that it's black. Which is really cool. It's black and when you put it on there and you let it dry, it hardens as one, one thing. And then you kind of just peel it off. And you can peel it off all in one unit. And it's not like you get, it's not like a Biore skin like that. And you're not going to have blackheads or anything coming out. But you just peel it off and then you take warm water when it's all peeled off. And you kind of rub it, rub the rest, the little bit remaining on around the edges and the temples. But I will tell you to be careful with this product around your temples because... If it gets caught on this, that mask is going to pull and these little baby hairs is going to come with it. So be sure to like keep your, have your hair back in the bonnet or stocking cap or whatever you do. And whenever I cleanse my face using the mask, whenever I cleanse my face after using the mask, whether it's this one or this one, I use this little chamois thing. I don't know why. I'm just like, hey, this is cute. Let me put this on my face. So I did. And I take the warm water to get this off. And I just, get you know, get it off. And, you know, once again, my skin feels awesome. I can say I have not had any breakouts. Just good skin, guys. And yeah, that was really fun just telling you what I use for my face. And one, some of the things that I'm doing as we go into the fall to keep myself moisturized. Because keeping yourself moisturized just like your hair, your skin. How can I say? It'll pay off in the long run when we get old and we won't have wrinkles and things like that. I'm working on these dark circles because I do need a nighttime treatment that is focused on these dark circles. But that's something that... I've just recently gotten it. I don't know if it's a combination of stress or I'm tired. I'm not getting enough rest. I'm not eating the right thing. So the dark circles, a little bit of bags in my eye, under my eyes, I'm working on it. So I'll keep you posted on that. But I just wanted to share that with you. And I keep playing with my hair because I love it. Oh, my God, it's so cute. Uh, <laughs> Alrighty, well, I'll talk to you next time. Bye, YouTube.